Welcome to A Bill a Minute from GovTrack, your short breakdown of interesting bills in Congress. I'm Jesse Rifkin. In his first month in office, New York City's new health-conscious mayor, Eric Adams, instituted vegan Fridays in public school cafeterias. Now he has floated that he may try to ban chocolate milk from public school cafeterias next. It would continue the trend in other blue states, such as the District of Columbia in 2010 and San Francisco in 2017. In March, a bipartisan group of U.S. House members representing districts, congressional districts from New York State, wrote to Mayor Adams expressing concern with his plan. While six of those signatories were Republicans, three of them were actually Democrats from the mayor's own party. Now, some of these signatories have introduced the Protecting School Milk Choices Act, which would require that any school which participates in the federal national school lunch program offer both unflavored and flavored milk options, such as chocolate milk. About 95% of public schools do participate in this program. The bill was introduced in the House by New York State's Republican Representative Elise Stefanik. Now, supporters argue that kids should have the option to choose what to drink rather than the decision being made for them by government bureaucrats. Opponents counter that even though you may associate chocolate milk with positive childhood memories, the health consequences can and do add up over time. Well, cheers. Or wait, sorry, uh, if you're from New York City, uh, cheers. <laughs>